Uh, what's going on, folks? It's the cool on out here, aka Music to a Dream, and I'm hot as hell. It's like a hundred degrees down here in Louisiana. Sucks. I have my little first tutorial for you. It's my first one, so bear with me. It's a little grunge effect. Nothing too hard. I'm gonna show you using it on Eminem, one of my favorite rappers. Yes. So what you do is open up a picture that you already have or just whatever I can find a picture there you go yeah so you can see the difference before after I'm gonna hide that right now so basically like I said this is like a darker grungier type effect if you will so what you do you open up your picture whatever right off the bat you come over here you duplicate your layer which you can also do using control J or command J if you're on a Mac but who uses a Mac am I right yeah I'm right um, now what you do is you go up here to filter go down to other high pass you put your radius on 5 so you could you can see the difference apparently that puts it all the way to gray interesting uh, then you hit OK blending mode over here uh, there's a ton of different blending modes that do a bunch of things they have different settings like right here they focus on the darks these focus on the lights I put a link down below in the description to my friend uh, Chill actually has a blending tutorial so if you want to learn more about blending modes and whatnot I'll direct you to that link down in the description yeah and there you go you have that effect right there and after you do that you come back to your original background layer duplicate hit OK pull that to the top hide that for a second so you can see what that the difference is then you come up here to image adjustments desaturate boom desaturate takes all the color making it black and white normal overlay again blah blam so let's go back it's pretty it's pretty simple not not you know not complicated at all so let's go back oh yeah and these are the hydro like I'm not deleting the layers or anything you're just hiding the view of the layers so you basically went from this to that to that and we, you see his face is a bit bright right here so what we're gonna do we're gonna come to image adjustments and levels levels they change the they change pretty much like contrast if you will the lights and the darks all at once you see as I move this middle one to the left it gets brighter and darker once I move over here but that looks bad and this moves it, it moves certain things I think this is like mid-tones this is uh, lights or something like that and this is shadows I'm, I'm not particularly sure but you know just mess around with it get get the lighting that you want to get because his face is pretty bright no racial no racial I think that'll work for now and we have something similar to what I started off with actually that's okay so yeah I think the left one on the one on the left is, is still pretty you know a little bit better these are the levels okay these are not the levels these are the levels for this one which means they were about right there or something like that uh, yeah once you go into levels if you want to change levels it'll add on to what you already have so if you think something should look different you have to go back and do edit undo levels or what's that control control Z boom yeah so yeah that's it um remember look in the description below for that blending tutorial by my boy chill and I hope you enjoyed this first little tutorial
I might be uploading a speed art tonight of Eminem. It depends on if I'm lazy enough to not do it before Raw or after Raw. Uh, WWE Raw Wrestling, by the way. Don't want to sound like I'm watching porn or something, but yeah. Peace.